Changing Perspective with Paint. A local artist and the Juvenile Justice Center are teaming up for a very special project. News 5's Lauren Wilson learned they're trying to close the gap between the teens and law enforcement. When these kids hear that sound, their emotions boil over. I really didn't like them. Abusers. There's a lot of uh, teenagers and young people think very badly of police officers. That is, until they meet artist Ricky Lewis. It's kind of part of the creative process. How does he do it? A right special away, art project. Our, we <laughs> colored it our own selves. I mean. The project, I Care About My Life and I Care About Your Life, is part of a diversion program from the East Cleveland Neighborhood Center. They offer kids with misdemeanors yeah. this instead of a sentence that will appear on the record. We're, we're trying to divert uh, them, the, their attention away from negative things, things that get them in trouble. At the same time, change their perceptions of law enforcement. And when they really began to think about it, they said, well, police, some of them, well, most of them, said, really, some of these policemen aren't really that bad. Every month, they work with Lewis right. and spend time with a police officer building a relationship. And it's also to help stimulate a positive dialogue between these teenagers and law enforcement. That dialogue painted on a canvas and later turned into a mural somewhere in Cleveland, getting teens like Darjale Moore to think twice next time she hears these. Now I kind of learn like it's protection, it's them protecting themselves. So, I mean, it's not right, but at the end of the day, it's not wrong if they still get to go home to their families like everybody else. The diversion program is actually an option. The teens can choose between this program or time in the detention center. The first mural is sitting inside the East Cleveland Rec Center. Lauren Wilson, News 5.